Hi there, lovers of food. Do you want to improve your cooking skills? Cooking oils may be the ideal addition to improve the caliber of your cuisine. We'll discuss seven excellent cooking oils today. We will also discuss the best ways to cook each type of oil, from avocado to canola. Shall we get started now? 1. Canola oil first up. Let's start with one of the most widely used cooking oils. Rapeseed is the source of canola oil, a vegetable-based oil. Canola has long been the preferred cooking oil because of its rich texture, light flavor, and high smoke point. Canola oil is typically thought of as being used for frying, but it is also excellent for baking and roasting. This makes room for a variety of cooking techniques, such as sauteing and stir-frying. Another excellent option to butter or margarine is canola oil. Canola oil has been stigmatized throughout the past few years. One that has made some people refrain from using it for cooking. You see, erucic acid is present in canola oil. This particular kind of monounsaturated omega-3 fatty acid has been connected to eyesight and respiratory ailments. It turns out that canola has less erucic acid than what the FDA considers safe. As it happens, canola is regarded as generally healthful. It has a low fat content of about 7% and a high monounsaturated fat content of 63%. Moreover, phytosterols included in it aid in the absorption of cholesterol. Having said that, canola oil should be used with caution. Though there are some advantages, research suggests that caution should be exercised. A 2013 study examined a sizable cohort of men who switched from unsaturated vegetable oil to saturated fats. Despite having low cholesterol, they had greater risks of heart and coronary artery disease. The reason for this needs to be investigated further. It is typically advised that you use canola oil sparingly, though the amount you use will vary based on what you are preparing. 2. Olivier Extra Virgin We now have another very well-liked cooking oil. Many experts believe that extra virgin olive oil is the healthiest fat available. Just inquire about nations where the Mediterranean diet is well-liked. They constantly make use of it. Which other cooking oil would you actually want to use? Olive oil is, to put it simply, an oil that is extracted from olives. Of the three primary types, extra virgin olive oil undergoes the least amount of processing. The other two are ordinary virgin olive oil and refined olive oil. Along with 14% saturated fats, it also has excellent levels of vitamin K and E. In monounsaturated fats, the major payoff lies elsewhere. Your daily value is 735 in one table. Additionally rich in antioxidants that aid in the battle against illness is extra virgin olive oil. It has anti-inflammatory and anti-cardiac effects. There are additional claims that it can fight cancer and Alzheimer's. Foods can be roasted or fried with extra virgin olive oil. It can improve the dish's flavor, color, and aroma, whichever you're cooking. It pairs especially well with soups, bruschetta, spaghetti sauces, and different types of cheese. It cooks best when the temperature is around 375 degrees Fahrenheit. 3. Vegetable oil Are you familiar with peanut oil? This is a great option if you want to give your food a really strong taste. Peanut oil, also called groundnut oil, is made from, you guessed it, peanuts. It works well for sautéing and frying dishes. It works nicely for peanut butter cookies and stir-fries alike. Its smoke point is high, at 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Peanut oil has a high monounsaturated fat content and a low fat content. This may help prevent heart disease by lowering cholesterol. Additionally, 11% of your daily vitamin E needs come from peanut oil. Consuming vitamin E serves as an antioxidant to shield you from harmful free radicals. Peanut oil can improve the flavor when cooked with the right food. It can enhance your cuisine in any way you like with a mild, medium, or strong taste. 4. Coconut oil If you're going to cook something on the stove, be sure it goes well with coconut oil. With a smoking point of 350 degrees, it can be used on meat, eggs, and fish among other dishes. In tea or coffee, a few of tablespoons also work well. There are some wonderful health benefits of coconut oil. For example, the saturated fat content in coconut oils is over 90%. Saturated fats make up over 60% of your daily intake in just one tablespoon. It is advised that you cook with no more than two tablespoons. 
belly fat is stated to be reduced by this amount. It's possible that using coconut oil will raise your good cholesterol. This is because it contains saturated fat, which lowers blood pressure. If this is accurate, it can stop the onset of heart disease. However, a 2016 study found no conclusive proof that using coconut oil raises or lowers cholesterol. Coconut oil reduces inflammation and harmful microorganisms while aiding in meal digestion. Having said that, you should use coconut oil sparingly. Look, it has a lot of calories. One tablespoon is equal to 117. Therefore, even though it improves the flavor of your food, it doesn't hurt to exercise caution. So far, is this list helpful to you? What mouthwatering recipes come to mind using these oils? The following one is certain to become a favorite. But before we go any further, are you worried about your general health? Would you want to see our most current video about the health benefits of eating an orange every day? Do you want to change things up? See our list of 17 reasons why dating a Leo is the best thing ever if you're searching for that special someone. Let's return to our ranking of the top cooking oils now. Avocado liquid expect health food maniacs to rush to the scene if the word, avocado, is spoken aloud. Avocado oil is extracted directly from the crushed fruit and is a fantastic complement to any cooking pan. Avocado oil pairs well with vegetables due to its elevated smoke point, which reaches up to 400 degrees. It's also supposed to be a useful addition to salad and homemade mayonnaise. It is a lesser known member of the coconut oil family and lacks the flavor of coconut oil, but it has a ton of incredible health advantages. Avocado oil can increase your body's absorption of carotenoids, which are crucial antioxidants that your body needs to consume when added to a salad that is high in vegetables. In addition, avocado oil can lower your risk of gum disease, raise your good cholesterol, and lessen arthritis. This cooking oil is a really useful tool for the kitchen. Oil of sesame and oil derived from sesame seeds? Enroll me, please. A loving moniker for sesame is, queen of the oil seeds. Any culinary enthusiast's pantry should include sesame oil, which is the perfect option for sauteing their favorite meals. Sesame oil, which has a smoke point of 410 degrees, works wonders in stir fries with beef and broccoli, noodles, and chicken. Just like every oil we've discussed, what happens next? It is also very beneficial to your health. First off, it's loaded with antioxidants that fight free radicals and lessen cell damage. In a 2013 study, rats were given supplements containing sesame oil by researchers. They discovered at the end that the animals were shielded from harm to their cardiac cells. Another study using rats shown that 42 days of exposure to a tiny amount of sesame oil led to a reduction in blood sugar. So get that sesame oil and take your best beef and vegetable pieces out of the refrigerator. I believe that eating a well-prepared stir-fry will benefit your health. Safflower oil This pick might be unknown to those of you who are new to cooking oil. Safflower oil, which is extracted from the spiky plant, is the best option when preparing a dish that needs a lot of heat. Really? For this frying oil, a 400-degree smoke point is nothing more than a toy. The high smoke point of sunflower is 510 degrees Fahrenheit. Safflower oil has the added benefit of being high in monounsaturated fats, which goes well with cooking. Research has demonstrated that safflower may have a positive impact on the health of those with type 2 diabetes. This includes everything, including blood sugar and cholesterol. According to a 2011 study, Using safflower oil for four months is necessary to notice improved cholesterol. Safflower oil is something you should get familiar with if you need to cook something at a high temperature. Are you a fan of cooking? After viewing this video, would you give any of these cooking oils a try? Tell us in the comments section below. We hope to hear from you soon.